I think if Robot's in the party, he'll tell you something like it takes 65 million and 2,300 years to recharge. <laughs> Precisely. Okay, not one second more. There's actual, there's an audible ding as it goes off. Wait, is this the... Has to be, right? Reptite player. The Reptite layer? Guy gets a job at a museum. So a while later, somebody asks him, how old is this dinosaur fossil? 65 million years and two weeks, he says. They say, how do you know that with such accuracy? And he replies, they told me it was 65 million years old when I started work here two weeks ago. Intent is to do Stardew tonight. I'm gonna touch base with Teak and we'll see if that's. Make sure that's what he wants to do. But well, that is the current intent is Stardew tonight. to the same location in time. Hmm. Where the heck's the Sun Temple? Sun Temple and Sun Shrine, different things? Maybe that's it. Never dark in here. Back to the timey! So glad we kept the name proper. Mm -hmm. No 
back to the future. It's gone. The moonstone is gone. No, the sunstone is gone. It's, it looks like it's been gone for some time. Let's try another time period. Start with the Middle Ages. Go forward, I guess. Drink capsule looks like it's doing just fine here at 600, though. isn't here either. What if somebody from this time period took it? Hint, hint. Hmm. If we fly around and look for a conspicuously shining building, we can get a hint as to its location. Moonstone? Never heard of it! <laughs> oh, hello. White vest. Black vest. Set of shadow damage and light damage. Interesting. Keep it in the bridge? No? Please let me move, lady. Thanks. I'm just gonna check various surfaces here. Kids don't like him. He'd never heard of a moonstone before. Does not appear to be a hidden moonstone here anywhere. something rather obtuse. <laughs> That's my guess. What do I need to do here? Oh, right. I have to do... Oh, this is where the jerky is? Yeah, all right. Uh, this is the jerky. Give his ancestors jerky for free. That's right. <laughs> right. Okay. Yeah. Let's uh. Let's let's get out of here. <laughs> uh. Although, where is the snail shop? Raj Gorajek, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Bishop Stars. Not 
this turkey. Oh, this shop, brother. Snail stop. Stop. Got some special spiced jerky, but I've been saving it for a special occasion. You got it, buddy. All right, we got the we got the special jerky. Tata's bride one day. Should we already open these two, right? So I missed my opportunity to get the upgraded versions. It's fine. Is that not spiced jerky you're carrying? She recognized immediately, spotting it out amongst the pile of sharp weaponry and horde of potions. She's got a keen nose and a sharp eye, I gotta say. Might you part with it for $10,000 reduce? No, you must take it for free, or else. Oh, thank you. I thought kindness and sharing gone from this world altogether. I'll teach my children with this jerky. There are greater things in life than money. And they will remember that lesson for at least 400 years as they pass the knowledge down from person to person. My dad is my favorite person in the whole world. I wish my husband were just a touch, le touch less generous. I mean, wouldn't it kill him to save a little for us? I love my dad. You are interested in the Moonstone. A passing young traveler left it here. By all means, take it. It seems to be important to you folks. I hope you didn't remove it from that cave for very long. Otherwise, we're going to have to wait a while. where a map would be really handy. I actually don't know where the sun thingy is uh, relative to where I am. I think of it as in the, the northwest corner of the map, but because the map wraps in both directions, it's impossible to know where I am relative to that. So... Actually, what I should have done was take this, this version of the Moonstone, bring it back to 65 million BC, put it there then. That's how you do it. Just keep making it go in a loop. Easy. The moonstone's there in that time period. You just put them next to each other. With energy like this, I should maybe be able to make a really powerful weapon. Let's take it back to my house. First, we'll extract the sunstone's energy and convert it into a more manageable form. Sunny D. Then we'll just vacuum pack it into a cartridge. And it's finished! It didn't take long. Did 
named Wondershot. Sometimes I amaze myself. Take a look at this, Luca. I borrowed a bit of the Sunstone. You didn't even know about the Sunstone. How did you borrow? Anyway. You got sunglasses. Too bad the wonder shot is hot garbage. You mean I did all that for nothing? Playtime <laughs> determines damage. <laughs> and just d take all the middlemen out and directly state that you have to grind to make it do more damage. Although is it, is it a, um, is it just like increasing the more playtime or is it, is it more like Robo's hit point thing where it's the last digit of seconds of the clock or something weird? Worth a, worth a try, but I think mostly you're not even trying to make basic attacks that often, right? Sneakily edits system time. Cap at 65 million years of playtime. <laughs> Here you go. Here you go. Yeah, Luca's pretty much pure mage, so having a, a weapon on her doesn't really do a whole lot. That's okay. I think we're pretty well equipped here. Um, such that, let's see, is there anybody else's side quest I actually care about? We did Luca, Magus, Frog, or Robo. We didn't do the Rainbow Stone thing. And then there's like Ayla or whatever. But I think we're all just about ready to, to try tackling the final dungeon. That's my guess. This party should be... Capable. Bushel's part of Nadia's, got it. I'm yet undecided as to whether I will actually use Nadia. But haste certainly is a thing, so that's tempting. Fantasia says the weapon's damage is multiplied by a differing factor depending on the last digit of the amount of seconds the game has been played. Okay, so it is a, a rotating wheel of damage. 10%, 50%, 100%, 200%, or 300%. So the average of those numbers... 660 divided by 6. An average of 110%. That's not numerically very good. Is it? If you're if you're assuming that you can't really keep track of the time. By the way, um, I missed this a few minutes ago. Flintlock, thank you so much for the five tip five dollar tip, saying what is Frog's favorite Slay the Spire card? Croak and Dagger. Oof. Oof. Should take the Rainbow Quest on. Okay. Actually, well, let's do that then. I've got a little bit more time here. the rainbow shell. We'll do that right now. It says I don't think it will take very long. The side quests were a lot shorter than I expected them to be. So we'll 
Quantum Cup or Nutty Eye. And yeah, it's definitely a little faster without uh, getting stuck anywhere along the way. Haloom, thank you so much for eight months in the tier one sub. Now, yeah, I've finally stumbled upon a hint as to the whereabouts of the rainbow shell. Still, I can't shake the feeling that things will go sour this time. Here, my luck may have finally run out. Say, would you mind holding on to this for me? Named Toma's Spirits. Should the worst befall me, it would mean a lot to me if you'd pour that on my grave. Much more, but I know, but I beg you. All right, well. You know what that means. Time to find his grave. Is the great explorer Toma Levine, sixth of third moon, 634. Splash some booze on that grave. Nadia, it's been many a day. I located the rainbow shell, as it were. The northwest of this cape is a large island called the Giant's Claw. The shell is there. Okay. But beware, there are droves of monsters afoot. They will surely give you many levels. Truly, there is no drink so fine as one shared in the company of friends like you. All the best. Um, must be talking about Middle Ages. What happens in the next 400 years that this entire island just goes away? Hello? All right. Oop. Those holes, perhaps they are meant to be jumped into. Yes, let's start all over. Cool throne. Is this the old Tyranno lair? A prehistoric castle. Cool castle. Uh oh.
Oh, oh another clarity cap. Just the one that prevents confused, that's right. Thankfully, he was immune to that, so he didn't really care. Save point first, so that, that's good. Expecting progress. Oh, well, that works too, actually. Too far to counterattack. Just counter Natty instead.
gemstone. Is that? Enables the Omega Flare Triple Tech. Ooh. Omega Flare. Uh, who has to wear this? And that's Luca Robo Megas. So one of the three of them has to have it equipped? Yes. Mm -hmm. 